I'm Ms. Artastic and in this video art tutorial we're going to be drawing a kite that's frustrating because or miffed miffed missed Google miffed um because it look at it's ah, ah the stripe oh okay so grab something to draw with and something to draw on and let's make some art episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, welcome back. Today is day 17. We're doing a kite. It's rather miffed. It's a miffed kite. Yes. Hey Google, define the word miffed. Mist has four different meanings. Starting with the most common one, miss can be used as a verb to mean fail to hit, reach, or come into contact with something aimed at, as in. Oh no. Hey Google, stop. That's missed. M I S S E D. Anyway, we're doing miffed. Um, miffed kite. Moving on. Otherwise, we're gonna be here all day trying to get Google to listen. All right. We're gonna be doing a kite. Here we go. Top right corner, two diagonal lines. Ooh, my marker's already going. Awesome, thank you so much Sharpie. I'm so proud of you right now. So excited. All right, two diagonal lines. New marker. Because Artist Loft and Sharpie are disappointing me lately. Especially Artist Loft, brand new markers. Already gone, thanks Michael. Michaels, yeah, Michaels. Good old Michaels, raising the prices and dropping the quality. All right, two more lines down, like that, so we have a diamond. All right, we're gonna give it a bow, so we're gonna draw a circle with two ovals on either side at the bottom. Draw a little line, circle, two ends, line, circle, two ends, line, circle, whoa, mistake, okay, how do we fix that, there we go, two ends, and then maybe, he's kind of blowing away, and this is why it's miffed, ah! well that's some expressive lines here, Okay, maybe here's the rest of its line here. All broken. Now he's flying away and that's why it's kind of agitated or miffed. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna give it a nice little face here. Again, it's kind of like, um, hello guys. Uh, there's something happening here that's not really supposed to be happening. So here we go. We're gonna draw two Kind of like U shapes, sort of, on either side of the kite's face. And then draw a circle below. Under each eye, draw an oval for some cheeks. And between the eyes, nice and small, we're gonna do an upside down U shape or a curving line for a mouth. I'm just gonna curve it under and kind of make it like a jelly bean there. Add a tongue and color in the dark of the mouth, leaving just that tongue nice and white. In each eye, we're gonna draw one circle and then color in the dark of the eye, just leaving that one circle nice and white. Two lines down for the kite frame. And we won't see the cross one because we have a face there. 
if you want, you can add other details around your design, such as some clouds hanging out in the background. It's really up to you. You do what makes you happy. Add your own artist flavor, of course. And once you're done, you can go ahead and color it in using your favorite colors and art making mediums. Once you're done, coloring in your kite, your lovely kite that's a little bit frustrated or annoyed that it kind of broke away from the rest of its string is done. Well, that's it for this episode. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, Ms. Artastic. And if you create anything and share it online on social media, please, please, I would love to see it. So tag me at Ms. Artastic and I will check it out or join the community and conversation and use the hashtag, hashtag Ms. Artastic. And I will check it out that way as well. And you can see what other people are creating who create with Ms. Artastic. YouTube videos. Well, that's it for this episode and I will see you in the next.